we're going to show the latest upgrade from my buddies at MNR Automotive. This is a pillar pod kit. Um, it comes with two lights. You can see um, uh, they have the four center LEDs, but then they also have side lighting um, and amber. So it's white in the middle and amber on the sides. They're 4,000 lumens each. Um, very uh, heavy duty looking, nice lights. Um, yeah, MNR Automotive, they are out of California and they make all sorts of light bars and things like that um, for Raptors, for TRXs, for, I'm sorry, not for TRXs, but for other vehicles as well. Um, Rams, Toyota, stuff like that. I actually ran their light bars, um, the grill mounted light bars in the Raptor. I had two of them. I had a white one and an amber one, 40 inch wide, beautiful uh, light bars, concealed, they don't show. And a bunch of people in our off-road group run them as well. Highly recommended. They have awesome customer service too. I I just email them uh, if, I, if I have any issues or questions or anything like that. And they're always really quick to respond. Um, so yeah, hit them up if you need anything. M&Rautomotive.com So here's what we're doing today. We're going to try to make this light kit work. This is actually, um, it's a Ram 1500 light kit. I ordered it from them. Um, and we're going to see if it will work on the TRX. Hopefully it does. Um, it, it, the way it mounts is pretty simple. I talked to Mike over there at m and Automotive. Um, yeah, he's the one who sent me the kit. And it comes with these two mounts that are... One end of them goes on the on under the hood. So that the lights go up and down at the hood. And the other end is, is where you mount into the light. But what's nice is... A lot of designs just have this flat piece of stock right here, and so it gets a little flexible and, and bouncy when you go over bumps. They actually gusseted it with this side plate you can see. It's nicely welded there and on the end, and then one spot welded in the middle as well. So looks like it's all powder-coated nicely as well, so shouldn't see any rust out of these guys. But uh, let me get the tripod set up, and uh, we'll go from there and see where everything mounts. Next, we're going to install the bracket for the driver's side. Uh, so I have that one right here ready to go, and the first thing you need to do is remove this clip, just like we did on the other side. There's actually a clip in here as well. This one's for the uh, windshield wiper sprayers. So we're just going to pull that one out. Might have to use pliers. Oh, there it goes. Pops right out. We'll zip tie that up later, um, but we need to use that hole for, for our mount. All right, so we went in and installed this bracket on the driver's side. I just want to show there should be a little gap in here, um, and then the the top part of the bracket right here uh, should be pretty flush with this plastic piece right here on the hood of the of the TRX and then when we close it um, it's actually gonna make even more room but we're gonna leave it a little bit loose right now and we're gonna test the windshield wipers at every step on the on the driver's side we want to make sure the windshield wipers when they come on they're not hitting it so I'm gonna go ahead and um, close the hood and test the wipers real quick So the wipers should not touch. Let me turn it up a little bit. If you look, see how close it is? But it's not touching, so we're good right there. That's all the light, now we're gonna test out the wipers one more time. Perfect. So there's barely any clearance there, it's really close. Uh, let me turn the wipers again. If you see how close it is. Very close, but we're not touching, so we're good. When the hood's open, we also tested with the hood open and it's not touching either, so I think we're good to go. We're gonna go ahead and wire this one in. Oh yeah. You can see they're very bright and they perfectly match the headlights and the white daytime running lights, um, the halos on the, on the headlights. So very cool. I'm pretty happy with them. Uh, and again, the, uh, these are all made by MNR Automotive. I'll post a link to their page, uh, to their website in the, in the comments of this video. But um, shout out to them. They're one of the first on them. I think they're the first on the market to come out with a kit for the Ram TRX. You can buy currently, there's another brand called Zeroads. Um, I do not recommend them because they actually use the mounts that uh, hold the, the hood onto the hinge. And so when you put them on, 
they actually lift the hood about a quarter of an inch. So you have a, a difference in height, like it'll come right here, and then this hood is actually a quarter inch higher than this section of the, of the body. So they don't work very well. They're not made for the Ram TRX. They're only made for the 1500. So these are actually the first kit for the TRX. Um, so definitely hit them up. I think they're 4,000 lumens each. Plus they have the yellow um, or the amber backlights. I don't have mine wired up yet, but I will eventually wire them up to where when I turn on my uh, yellow uh, running lights, they'll come on as well. So, yep. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Uh, sorry, it might have been a little longer video than I, than I was hoping for, but um, hope that gives you some insight on, on uh, which pillar pods to go with. Thanks. Bye.